hey guys what's up welcome to the video and in today's video i will be showing you a very unique 20 charms these charms are actually a representation of the original 20 icons for the operators every operator had uh, like the same picture the same icon for like his uh, in-game icon so after the game released uh, for some reason which i have no idea why uh, Ubisoft decided to give us the icons that we already have in the game and put these like I think scrap them onto our, at whatever I think sometimes around that not sure uh, they decided to make these as charms which in my mind it's like the best move by Ubisoft I got them uh, it's around 10 bucks and at the end of the video I will show you where you can buy them uh, I think they are just amazing very very well made very very like very good quality i was super excited when i got them and super happy when i got them so let's get started the first one about fuse if you don't know the shape of this uh, particular uh, charm if you think okay this is a quite simple charm it's actually the same representation of uh, like uh, an explosive or the explosive materials that we, you see on warning labels or on a on a, ga a gasoline tractor or things of that nature so this demonstrates that the nature of uh, fuse he, he basically blows shit up you know and i think this looks amazing uh we have capcan i mean this was a kind of a doozy for me but because i was like what the fuck is this you know is, is it a circle is it a mind is it a kind of a knife and it clicked it was an actual scorpion's tail or a representation of a scorpion tail which makes sense because Capcan is a lurker he's a trap operator uh, a lot of scorpions in nature actually would wait for their prey to come uh, somewhere near at them and kill them not all of them but a lot of uh, scorpion species which I think is just a fitting uh, charm to give for uh, such an operator now we goes for uh, we go for Montaigne and number one I mean we all know Montaigne that is always the guy that pushes forward you know like he is at the tip of the spear because he has a big ass shield basically I think it just looks amazing. Now Ash Ash has one of the simplest but yet very accurate representations of uh, of her ability which is basically destroy a wall or two or destroy everything and go in gun blazing and this is the power of ash and this is why we fear ash so much it was like oh fuck it's ash i have to be extra careful in getting that headshot because she will rip me apart with her r4c i mean it's amazing and moving on to sledge and this is quite obvious this is a representation of his hammer because his name is sledge he has a big ass hammer I think it looks very very effective like very very good I mean I'm actually surprised when I got them I thought they were just like gonna be a picture and like someone was clearly like drew them very quickly and very rapidly when you actually give them a closer ro look right here you can see that the a lot of them have the texture of uh, of like uh, threads or leather or plastic or whatever you can I, I can almost swear that a lot of these uh, charms will actually made made in real life then scanned by a laser or something like that and then put in the into the game by the way if you are wondering what kind of skin do i have equipped right now it's uh, the eldorado skin you can get it for 25000 right now now we're gonna move to rock which is very very clear right here rock uh, g-i-g-n you have the floor Dunis, you have the actual uh, a part of the castle or a watchtower of a castle which uh, it kind of represents him because he's always the, the guy that will hold down the objective if you have a rock on the objective that guy is good so this is to him and i think it looks amazingly beautiful and very artistic i was actually surprised how good this charms looks i mean i know that you see them right here and you're thinking oh they look good because it's so, so zoomed out but while like while in game they actually pop out 
uh, like I quit them two or three days ago and a lot of I get a lot of my messages whether from the other team or my team and say hey where did you get this job where can, where can I buy it so this is why I decided to make this video you have bandit which is just amazing you have the skull symbolizing like death he's an an outsider uh, like he's a rogue and you have this uh, handkerchief which is basically a bandit saying hey I'm a bandit now one of my favorite which is Plitz. this is basically Medusa Medusa is a character I think in, in Greek mythology which uh, has a uh, instead of hair has snakes and every uh, and any um, person who would look at her will uh, be turned into stone make the connection yet or not place you see him he flashes you can't see anything so it's it's quite a, a subtle connection and I actually love it I mean when you equip this on his uh, on his shield it's just like right there you know he can't miss it for a second now the triangle for castle or the triple triangle I think this symbolizes unity or symbolizes I think I think it symbolizes unity I'm gonna look for the symbol uh, right after I make this video uh, I think it's just fitting because you have those three uh, triangles which represent his three castle barricades and that uh, yellowish uh, uh, that reddish line which we actually see on his barricades okay moving on to IQs IQ because she can actually see everything and uh, has the owl for a symbol because she can see everything uh, I mean I'm talking about gadgets here and can take them out I think this is quite nice of them because the, you know like she has like these angry eyes you know I can see you I can see your gadgets which is quite amazing actually now glass again one of my favorites I mean you can tell that the score represents death the top hat represent uh, like a character who is so somewhat sophisticated because at his operators video he says like do you know what's the difference between me and an, like a uh, like a comment between me and an artist details but the stakes are uh, on my end is much higher something like that I, I can't remember it very clearly and you have this monocle on his right on the right eye of the skull demonstrating that he can see you and, and you can see and you can see him and it's somewhat accurate now because of the latest buff where he can see you through smoke and you can see him which I think is somewhat of a funny like, like a funny timing by my part now going for dark this is the tree of life I think it's sim it was symbolized by a lot of cultures around the world this uh, tree that gives life to everything and anything around it dark he gives health he revives people yeah the connection is pretty clear again one of my favorites here which is Jaeger Jaeger means I think it's German means the hunter so what is a better represent a representation of a hunter than a wolf I mean wolves are the most efficient hunters in the world but I mean this gives you something about uh, Jaeger I know a lot of people will go okay he's the lone wolf but mm, maybe Jaeger is best suited when working as a team like you know this is like a hint by Ubisoft or a hint by the developers okay he is the lone wolf but something stronger than the, lo than the lone wolf is a pack of wolves so maybe not, no, I don't know going for mute mute with his classic uh, charms and icons just like a simple X when you know there is a mute your drones will be dead you can't push for the objective you are basically denied I love this okay now going for pulse I was I was like uh, I, when I first got them I was like why didn't I make the like the background may, maybe like more black instead of gray and the heart is like red maybe like some splash of blood like between now and then but like when I thought about it even I mean a bit longer this is what you see at the kill cam like if you if pulse sees you on his cardio scanner you're there you're dead and you're gonna see that charm uh, on the kill cam is going to be amazing though so 
again one of my favorites is stature i mean the like bluish uh, neon green blue skull like with those waves which i think this is a representation of his actual gadget his actual grenades which he throws it everybody goes dark every gadget is destroyed and it's a very amazing icon i mean i, I mean i was surprised when i got this for thatcher i was like god damn this is this is actually fucking amazing now moving on to the lord tijanka this is actually when i when i looked at it, it was like is this a hand or then i actually got a closer look at it and it's like these are actually three horses now the word for tijanka means russian i think it's uh, around the first start of the 20th century there was some kind of a gorilla war happening in russia so they would mount these uh, types of lmgs that they manufacture on the back of horse horse carriages and they would drag them all over the place like positioning them in tr uh, strategic locations and getting the upper hand of the enemy the russian uh, made up uh, the word to chanka or actually gave the word to chanka to the entire carriage like he is basically a mounted lmg the tichanka is there the tichanka is over there you get the picture which i think it's very fitting like it's uh, when if someone does not know like the history or the or the meaning of the word tichanka is uh, it's not just he's gonna look okay horses i bet you'll google this up and you'll know it's, it's very cool again my favorite which is smoke not only this is very simple, not only the yellowish background is uh, somewhat uh, of a hint to his yellowish smoke, but you can actually see like at the the mouth of the skull, he the skull is actually wearing one of these uh, like mask, gas mask. So you can like you can tell you're gonna die by my smoke, but I'm not gonna die. That's <laughs> that's his uh, charm. Of course, Thatcher, the devil, because he plays with fire, and I mean, this is like it's very well made, you know, like the details, uh, the shadows, the highlight, everything. I mean, it just looks amazing. Um, one of my least favorites, actually, which is Switch. I mean, I think they could have made a better job with it, but it's, uh, I mean it's like um, a throwback to her uh, to her gadget or a connection to her gadget because and uh, in her operator physio you're gonna see like this uh, all these gears uh, clutching and working together all these wires and chips and ic's and whatever and her operator video so this is somewhat like she is dependent on this uh, drone to get the job done which is i, I think the it's just amazing so, so this is it for today's video guys I'm just gonna give you a quick demonstration of the skin which is Eldorado skin it's available now for 25,000 right now uh, for the seasonal universal skin I suggest you get it because I did not find a single weapon where this skin is bad I mean it's just amazing you put it on the shotgun uh, it's it's like a completely different skin when you put it on the C8. You put it on a pistol. It's completely different skin from any other. I think this is the very best skin in the game right now. So guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, if you have any um, anything, basically write them down in the comments. And yes, I did not forgot. I will show you how to get the uh, the charms here. So you go to the digital digital content, you press it, season two year pass, the chunkas, Bushido set. I might be uh, I might think like to get this one. I think it looks amazing. Uh skip down. Pa 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 pa, pa Safari bundle. Where was it? Huh. I think I skipped it. Oh, uh, actually you can't, uh, it does not show anymore uh, because I got it, so you can't re like rebuy it. So you, you go to the digital content, I think you are going to find them somewhere around here. Like, uh, I think it's one of these. You can get them for US dollars, you don't have to, uh, to buy like uh, 
uh, R6 credits and then buy them you can just buy them with any with real with the US dollars I think it's uh, it's, it's quite good a uh, bunch of charm and it will stick out because not a lot of uh, players out there have them so guys again thank you so much for watching and I will see you in another video